Hey y'all, y'all ain't gonna believe this. I didn't know what to do. I couldn't find no chickens, couldn't find no bullfrogs. So we found these little things. What we're gonna make is bullfrog chicken. Yeah, that's what I said, bullfrog chicken. Y'all watch this, it's gonna be amazing. All right, y'all, we're gonna get these little bitty, little bitty chicken, and we're gonna cut the last part that jumps off the fence off. We don't need that. That's the last piece that jumps over the fence, so we don't worry about that. Okay, we're gonna take these, and uh, this front little joint on the chicken leg, we're gonna cut that off right there. We'll get to another side, we'll cut it off. We're gonna cut them both off, and I'm gonna show y'all what we're gonna make. I'm telling y'all, you ain't never seen nothing like this before. We're gonna take this chicken, we're gonna cut it right here. Come on, open up. Let me get this, this razor knife open here. Okay. Come on. Cut that leg down a little bit. We'll turn around to the other side. Cut that skin right there. Look at that. Cut the rib cage down there. And then we're gonna, we're gonna break it. And just break it down. Break it down. Now what we got? We got a bullfrog. When you get a chicken and whatever you get, you can have fun with it. Cut it up different ways, make different things with it. I mean, this is something fun I do. The kids love it. I mean, you put one on these on the kids' plate, they're going to tear it to pieces. And uh, just something fun. Looks good, fun, easy to make, and it's definitely different. All right, y'all, let's get with it. and We're going to season this chicken up. I'm going to show y'all the first thing I'm going to do. Get y'all some of the spray butter and just spray it down real good. You gotta watch the wind, y'all. The wind will get you out here today. I like to add this butter, y'all, because it makes it the seasoning really stick good. That's the only reason I add the butter. Plus, it makes the skin crispy. Okay, y'all, I got a lot of butter on here, huh? Butter makes it better, baby. Mm-mm-mm. All right, y'all, we did the butter. Then we're gonna drop a little salt on it. We got a good bit of salt, really. Oh, yeah. A little bit more on this one. Y'all, this is just something very fun to cook. Get us a little pepper on here. Mm hmm You don't have to overthink it when you season it. Just salt, pepper, and garlic. A um, little onion powder. That's all you need. It ain't got to be too fancy. I'm telling you what, it's going to be definitely going to be good. All right, we got that, that. Got a little bit of this roasted garlic, y'all. Put a lot of that on here. I mean, a lot of time the wind is blowing out here and uh, it's blowing the season everywhere, so we just put a little extra on it. It don't matter. It blow on the next frog. <laughs> okay, I got my, my griddles on low. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna dump a little oil on here. Okay, we dumped a lot of oil on there. All right, y'all. I'm gonna jump over here. We're gonna take this bullfrog, we're gonna put it right there. Look at there, let her cook, let her cook. We got one more over here. Mm -mm. Gonna turn it over right here. Stretch them little legs out. Ain't that pretty looking, y'all? You don't want it too hot, cause you'll burn them. Okay, we're gonna let them slowly cook over here. Let me add a little more salt on this side here. Just for season. A little bit of pepper. Now, that's looking like a bullfrog now, ain't it? Bullfrog and chicken is totally different. A lot of people say it just tastes like a, uh, a chicken, but I, I don't think it does. I think bullfrog has their own flavor. We're gonna cover this up. This whole thing got a story behind it, y'all. We had a hurricane come tear the whole building down. And it blew this about halfway down the block there, but they got it back and it still works. So we're gonna let that sit a little bit. We're gonna go over here and take a nap for a few minutes and then we're gonna come back and get her done. 
All right, y'all, this has been about five, six, seven minutes. I'm not sure. Uh, we're going to turn these over to the other side, y'all. Come on. Ooh, is that looking good? Yes. Looking real good. Ooh, wee. Come on, jump over here. We're going to get this about 10 more minutes, and then we're going to come back and check on it. Lift the lid up. Might well throw this over. Let me grab my temperature probe here. Here we go. Yes, that is super cooked. What we're gonna do, we're gonna slide these chickens off this side. We got this still heated up cooking. And y'all jump over here. And we're gonna, uh, I'm gonna scrape this down just a little bit. Hey, I might just pick it up and throw it away, what do you think? All right. We're gonna squirt a little oil on this side. We'll smear it around. I really don't want to overthink these vegetables. This is really easy. I want to show you how we do this. We're going to drop them green beans right here. Let them start cooking. Y'all come over here and watch this. And y'all, I hate mayonnaise. You can ask my wife. I don't like to touch it. I don't look, up, look at it. I don't want nothing to do with it. But it works real good with this recipe here. We're going to roll this corn in this a little bit. We're going to roll them all in it. You could use butter, but I'd rather use mayonnaise because it. I don't know. It really helps the season stick to it. I just don't like it touching my fingers. Mm. Let me go wash my hands. Y'all, y'all think I'm joking. You can ask me, Jen. I don't want to touch my. Get off my. Get off. Get up. Get. Get. I don't even want this no more. Mm. All right, y'all. We're going to season this down pretty good. Salt. Now, this is something fast to cook, y'all. Fast and easy. That's why I said we had so much fun making the bullfrog. So now we're going to make the, make the corn season it up real good. Don't worry about it a little bit blowed off. We got a little bit of onion powder right here. Got some roasted garlic. We might want to try that too, huh? Now that, that makes that corn real spicy. I'm going to turn it all over to the other side again. Don't like that mayonnaise on my fingers, I ain't going to lie. Spice it up. Okay, come over here. We're gonna put this on that griddle. We'll let it cook. I mean, this is just simple and it's fun. I'm gonna turn this one up, let it cook. Look at our little pretty little bullfrogs. Oh, how y'all doing? Well, let's check back on these in about four minutes. All right, y'all, we did it. This is fun deal. We had a good time doing it. We're gonna cut all these fires off. I'm gonna get my plate, we're gonna plate it up, and we're gonna eat this bullfrog. Oh, got our green beans. Watch this, y'all. Mm-hmm. Y'all think we can do two at a time? Watch this. Ooh, yes indeed. Uh-oh. Well, we're just eating two corns today. That's all we need. Because we only had two bullfrogs. But watch this, y'all. Got everything cut off. We're gonna put these bullfrogs over here. Y'all don't let them jump off the plate. We got our little bullfrogs here. But we ain't through with the bullfrog. Watch this, y'all. Y'all know I got bull with me. I can get my little poop pick. Break it in half. And watch this, yeah. Put one eye there. Come here, come here, little. None of two pick. Break it in half. Now look up there, y'all. All right now, people say don't play with your food, but wasn't this fun? This wasn't it. Bullfrog chicken. You ever seen such a thing? Your kids will love it. Your adults will love it. And, uh, ooh, y'all, look at that. Look at that. Mm. Y'all, that skin is just so crunchy and crusty. So good. So good. You got to try this. This corn is delicious. Look at it. I can't even hold it. Look at this corn. Look at that. Whoever said don't play with your food is wrong. I've been playing with this frog and this corn and these green beans, and I'm having me a good time.